Good morning, everyone. Um, it's so fantastic to welcome you all here today for our second Generative AI event, and really great to see uh, so many people coming back. I can make me say anything, and it looks kind of real. And that's what I'd like to talk to you about, generative AI, how psychology and understanding human behaviour is going to be a really big part of anything if it's going to be successful, and especially how that's going to be merged into financial services. Imagine that tomorrow morning you wake up, but you're not in your bedroom at home, you're in a simulation that they have created for you. So are we ever going to get to the point when AI can actually replicate humans? The more we've gone on this journey, the more we've come to the conclusion that we don't want to take humans completely out of the process. So this is the uh, sort of the, the merging of minds and machines, isn't it? That's what we're, we're here to talk about. You can try and teach people whatever you want, but it's going to be useless if you don't have the whole of society organised so that humans still have a valuable place. So we all accept that there is an advice and savings gap. AI is going to be efficient, and it's going to be efficient at what we tell it to do. And it might do things that we didn't expect in order to meet that efficiency target. But we can say we designed this product for people just like you based on the information you've given us, and I think that's going to really change our ability to help more people. Picking up on you know why we've, you know what we need to do to connect with people more, what we need to do to to build technology that's meaningful for people's lives. Is there a way of quantifying bias? And is there a way of, you know, ideal ways of, of solving for it? General question uh, about what the panelists think might be the long-term future of advisor charging structures. About how Gen AI scores better than 90% of lawyers on the bar. If you're clear with the customer around what you do, and then the technology lives up to that, that's fundamental to, to building trust. Reach out to us. Um, we're very much in the kind of building phase and, and learning phase around all this kind of stuff. And uh, we want to partner with as many of, of you firms as possible in doing so.